Being a student athlete in high school is one of the biggest commitments you'll make. And well, I know firsthand because, well, I am a student athlete. But not only am I a student athlete, um, the captain of my varsity basketball team as a junior, and I have a very high GPA. How do I do it? I'll show you. See, I'm not the smartest kid around or anything like that, for example, you know, with my academics, but the one thing that I do credit myself for is having excellent time management. See, my screen time on my phone, it never really exceeds over three hours, which is very good for, for most, and I think, you know, I could get it down even more. But a lot of the time, I just finish all my work, you know, during lunch if I have any homework to do because I realize that I won't have time when I get home. So budgeting my time is extremely important, so I have it set in schedules. So, for example, I get extra help when I can, you know, uh, if I'm staying after school for practice but it doesn't start till later, um, go to, you know, get tutoring during lunch, I'll finish my work during lunch. See, lunch is a perfect time to really get that work done and for me I just eat in other classes I have pretty chill teachers if you don't of course you know try to eat your food at different times I don't know what to tell you but lunch is an excellent time to finish your extra work here's another um, another part of this <laughs> a lot of y'all are not gonna like this one but if you wanna have great academics you have to get everything done ASAP you can't have assignments start piling up. You can't have any procrastination when you're a student athlete. Because, look, I, for me personally, I have to get everything done. Because I know for a fact when it's the weekend and I have time to work on my game and you know, actually just take a chill pill for a bit, I don't want to be doing stacks on stacks of work. I would probably go insane. Stop procrastinating. Do the work now so you don't have to do it later. Hey, as you can already tell, I'm a junior in high school, and I really have to budget my time to make these videos. I love making them, though, but please, it would do me a lot. Please subscribe. Thank you. You have to cancel your plans when needed. A lot of times, you're not going to be able to go to those you know, parties or go to any of those events because you're so busy with your schoolwork and your sport. If you want to be responsible, if you want to be you know, a man, you will do this. You'll have to say to your friends, hey, man, I can't hang out today because, you know, I, I X, Y, and Z. For me, oftentimes, I just say, hey, look, man, like, I'm not hanging out today. I, I, it's just not happening. I don't even give a reason. They just, My friends just know I'm committed because, well, that's my identity. I'm a committed basketball player that also focuses on his studies. One of the final pillars of this is focusing on only what matters. See, Kobe Bryant talked about this. He said something about obsessing over the game. He said, the world became my library because I only focused on things that helped me get from here to here and help create that, that you know, upward trajectory. He said, anything outside of that realm, you know, if it's over here instead of where he's at and where he needs to go, he just didn't even pay attention to it because in his words, you know, I just didn't have time for it. It really should tell you something. See, that's one of the greatest, you know, players of all time with one of the greatest work ethics. We can learn a lot from Kobe. You know, rest in peace. All right, bro, I hope you learned something, and I hope this helped you in some way. Thank you for watching. Remember to keep God first. Good luck.